Hi ladies, so many of you have been asking me the question, how do I hide my belly fat and at the same time emphasize my waist? Well, in this video, I'm going to give you simple tips and tricks on the best stuff to hide your belly fat. So if you're comfortable in the belly area and you want to look elegant, sexy, or you're a gentleman, single or married, and you want your partner to look sexy and gorgeous, you keep watching. Welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for tuning in. I'm Benita, welcome to Natnola Image Consulting, a place where you can come to feel good about yourself and to learn new things to do about body confidence, image building, styling teams, beauty and fashion. Please, if you are new in this channel, do me a big, big favor, click the subscribe button and turn on your notification bell to be notified whenever I post new content. So today we'll be talking a very sensitive topic and this is one of the areas that we women struggle with when, it, when we grow old or as we grow older. We all are different in shapes and sizes and that makes us unique. However, many women, no matter, where they, no, no matter whether they are naturally smaller or larger, tend to develop a tummy during perimenopause or menopause or due to childbearing. For some people, their stomach really, really, it's a concern. And for others, it's not. So what we're here to do today is solution. Quick style tips that has nothing to do with exercise. It's the quick way to look your best and it's the quick way to hide your belly and also makes your silhouette look pretty. So if you employ some of the styling tips that I'll be giving you today, you'll start feeling better and more confident and you're going to feel more like you. So here are the quick tips to think about when you go to shopping or whenever you go shopping for tops to hide your belly and make sure you stay tuned until the very end because at the end of this video I'll be giving you an extra tip on how to conceal your tummy using your best features or your assets. So let's get started. Tip number one is to keep it under control. And the only way to keep your tummy under control is to have the right underwear because the right underwear can lift, hold, and as well smooth all your natural attributes. So you want to avoid tight underwear and loose underwear. So you want to go for a underwear that is fit. I mean the right fit underwear. And if you're blessed in the bust area, it's really important you get a good supportive bra. The reason be that it helps in lifting the bust and then you're able to define your waist. Another way you can hide or another way you can keep your belly under control is to look for high waist underwear. It helps to hold in the belly patch, love handle and everything going on around the tummy area. It also gives you that sense of comfort and security. So ladies, we need a core group of problem solving pieces in our wardrobe, like going for a good shapewear. They are your wardrobe secrets, weapons, and they are the unseen items that let you pull on your outfit with total confidence. And it's always worth remembering that when you feel good, you look good too. Tip number two. Wear a false or surplus wrap style tops. It's no surprise that wrap are so flattering to all body types. It helps you to pull in that smallest part of your waist and the flowing part of it will help to conceal your belly. So if you are a new mom and you've got a little bit of extra there, wrap tops are perfect and will make your, and will make your belly feel comfortable. You want to go for a top that cinches in at the waist and flare out hiding your tummy. Another good way to hide the belly fat is to wear body skimming tops. Most ladies when, it, when, when trying to hide their belly wear baggy clothes. But actually when you wear baggy clothes sometimes that can make you look bigger, bigger and bigger than you actually are. 
So the big tops are not doing you any favor and it's not giving you shape as well. So it actually exaggerates your overall size. Instead, opt for body skimming tops that is so close to the skin and tops that fits in the chest and arms that gently skims over your body without being tight. So if you want to look stylish, it's best not to wear tops that a tight top because they will actually emphasize your love handles, tummy bubbles and draw attention away from you and your beautiful clothes. Tip number three, wear bodysuits. Bodysuit is so flattering because they work to flatten the lower tummy area. It pulls in love handles and also compress tummy area. I know some ladies do find it uncomfortable to wear because of the little clip or the little clippers around the bottom, but you can wear it without clipping it. I don't clip mine, but sometimes I do. And it all depends on the material and the size of the fabrics. Tip number four is to wear ponchos. As you can see from the image, it hides everything. The only thing about wearing poncho is to take the volume proportion into consideration. Since the upper part is bigger, you want to make sure that the lower part of your body is tailored and streamlined and fitted to your body, like wearing it with a skinny trouser or leggings. Another way you can hide your belly fat is to wear ruffles or peplum, or wearing a peplum top. Finding the right peplum is very slimming and will definitely hide your tummy. But you have to be careful when choosing ruffles because if chose in the wrong places, it can actually emphasize your belly rather than concealing it. So you can either go for um, ruffle which skims over your tummy to disguise it, or you look for tops that has ruffle in different places to draw attention away from the belly. And for your peplum, look for a peplum that the center seam is right under the bust and let the white peplum scale over the tummy and the hip area. Just a quick reminder, if you have not subscribed to this channel, hit the subscribe button right there. Can you see it? Hit it. Thank you. Tip number six, choose asymmetrical tops to hide your belly because it creates vertical and diagonal lines and breaks up your silhouette, especially those tops that start on the left and then go vertical down to the right. They are great at disguising tummies, like wearing a crossover top and a symmetrical tunic, very effective in hiding belly fat. Tip number seven, Go for an empire waistline top to highlight your waistline. So with, uh, with the empire waistline top, it might work for you and it might not work. Traditionally, it looks like it's actually designed for pregnant women. So if you have a round tummy, it's going to be unflattering because you don't want to look like you are six months pregnant. So it's a no-no for you. But if you have a wide tummy, then the empire waistline can definitely work as and as well hide your belly. That because it generally highlights the area just below your waist, your, just below your underboss, which is the narrowest point of your torso if you have a small belly. Tip number eight is to look for a strategic design detail tops, like not front tops that has a knot under the boss. The knot details is fantastic for anyone who would like to disguise a tummy area. Another good top is ruching top. They are both stylish and perfect. The good thing about it is that no matter how blotted your tummy is, it's not going to show. Tip number nine is the length of your sleeve. If your sleeve ends right at the point where your tummy and your waist is, is the widest part then attention will be drawn to that area. So, you, so when choosing sleeves, depend on your arms. Either hold for a shorter sleeve or a full length sleeve so that the eyes is not being drawn to that area that you are trying to minimize. Don't have the sleeve ending right at the elbow because when your hands are down, will highlight your widest part. And don't worry, 
in a video coming up soon, I'll be talking more about the length of the sleeve and how to downplay your hands. So if you haven't subscribed already, then you may want to consider subscribing so you don't miss out. Also, ladies, make sure you hit the notification button and subscribe because that way YouTube will let you know whenever I upload new video and I'm sure you don't want to, you, you just don't want to miss it or you don't want to miss all my good tips. All right, let's go back to the tips on flattering tops to hide your belly. Tip number 10 is to wear top with small prints a pattern. Small prints are very effective in hiding bellies and you should consider adding a few in your wardrobe. The beauty of wearing printed top is that the print just confuses the eye so it doesn't direct the eye to one particular area of the body. The smaller the print, the more that print minimizes your body and obviously the larger the print, the larger you appear. A random print all over keeps the eye moving to skim over areas you want to hide and the best optical illusion is to wear black and white patterns and they are so lovely with white trousers. The other trick that I use often is to create vertical lines. So if you are wearing tops with vertical lines or, line, or, if, or if you're wearing a top with lines, make sure they are vertical lines. Try as much as possible not to wear horizontal lines. It's a no because that will make you appear wider and wider and wider. And also, white stripe can make you look visually bigger. Make sure you try as much as, as possible to choose top with small, narrow prints. Stay on the same matter when it comes to fabrics and you're trying to conceal your mid session. You don't want to, you, you just don't want to appear bulky because that's what happens. So it's best to look for lighter weight fabrics or woven fabrics. What or woven fabrics will help to conceal your tummy. Soft clothes that drips is a gentle way to disguise extra weight in the tummy and avoid sheer fibers, which adds more volume to your overall. When it comes to you trying to hide that part of your body that you don't want people to see, you have to take the length into consideration. And I think it's up to you for comfort. I've seen women with large tummy look phenomenal in tuck-in blouses or tops that hit right at the waistband. Why others look better with tops that hit in the mid hips? So if you prefer some length to cover the, the rail, I say go for longer tops. Let's do some activity. I want you to place your hand on the widest point of your tummy. Go ahead. Put your fingers on the widest part of your tummy. Have you done that? Okay, good. Now, your top needs to go just below that. Just below that. Another way you can hide your belly is to embrace dark colors. I'm sure most of you have heard that dark colors are very slimming colors like charcoal, navy, black, and brown. Create the illusion of smaller frame while also hiding your wrinkles and bulging fabrics. So it's just the way the high sees things. If, if things are wider, we are able to determine how far away things are. If they are darker, it's hard for us to distinguish it. So if your midsection is larger than your bottom half, create a more proportionate look by wearing dark clothing on top and light clothing or light colors on the bottom. Don't put lighter colors on the part you want to conceal. You want to use dark colors because it's going to help you hide the problem area. I find that hiding third layer helps to hide belly fat, love handles, fupa, tummy bubbles, and everything going around your midsection. And it helps to create a vertical line that slims the whole body. So if you have a tummy, you want to, you want to go for solid inner with prints. Next tip is wearing a fuller top when you're trying to conceal a tummy. And yes, this is good looking and it does work, but you have to be careful that you don't fall into maternity style dressing. And anytime you go for tops that has quite a lot of volume, you run the risk of actually just looking bigger than actually you are. So what I really like is to do, what I like doing is do a little bit of, 
half talk and it's super flattering when you do half talk because you don't want to appear like you are actually wearing something very large so here are the extra tip i promised you at the beginning comes in and it's all about playing up your best futures and your best assets so if you don't want people to see your tummy area play up that part of your body that you really really love everyone has those areas either it's your leg your face your boobs arms or your eyes whatever it may be whatever your asset is play it to your strongest play up that point and put the focus there in terms of fashion choices and try not to put focus in that area you want you're trying to disguise you may not have or you may not be confident about your tummy but what about that part of your body or that part you like so much could you show off your cleavage or showcase your lovely legs or your hands or i like your shoulder if you like your legs you could place the focus there instead of your tummy you could wear some lovely printed jeans to show your legs and a plain tops so that the eyes is drawn to your legs rather than your belly or rather than drawing the eyes up you could draw the eyes down a pair of bright sunshine yellow shoes will put the attention on your feet and your legs rather than your tummy if you have a beautiful arms go sleeveless bring attention to your arms it's all about hiding that part you don't like and drawing attention to that area you like. So ladies, can all these tips remove belly fat? No, but they may flatter your figure and make your tummy and your love handles legs prominent. And finally, the most important styling tips to wear is confidence. When you feel good, you look good, you stand taller, you have better posture, you rock your heart fit, and people notice the whole package, the amazing woman. Thanks for watching this video, ladies, and I hope you have found these tips very useful and that you are ready to put these tips into action. I would like to read in the comment below what you think about this video and what you found useful and what maybe you'd like to hear more of so that I can bring you styling tips that will make you look beautiful and elegant. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel. And turn on your notification bell so you'll be notified whenever there's a new video. Like this video and share it to your friends, family, send it over and put it on your Facebook Instagram, Twitter, and other social platforms. It's your girl Benita. Until next time, you take care of yourself, and I hope to see you all in my next video. Ciao, ciao.